how to measure and evaluate light scattering in display. New instruments and approaches to measuring bidirectional scattering distribution function, called BSDF, make it easier and faster to evaluate light scattering of electronic display and determine their performances. But first, what is BSDF scattering? Here's a formula. The BSDF formula is this one on the screen, where L is a luminance on the sample surfaces at observer direction, E illuminance on the sample surface from the source direction, and delta is a wavelength. The BSDF measurement of a display characterizes how the light is reflected from any display surface or material. But now, how to measure the BSDF scattering of a display? Synopsis offer multiple solutions for measuring the light scattering properties of display. The results can be imported in optical design software, such as Light Tool, for optical system ray tracing and virtual prototyping. You can also purchase an instrument for high resolution BSDF measurements, such as the Mini DV2 or the Reflet 180S. In just a few steps, you can configure the instruments to measure the display BSDF and quickly provide results. If you do not need an on-site instrument for scattering measurements, Synopsis also offer on-demand scattering measurement in its light and temperature control laboratory to provide the most accurate measurement of environment for any samples. Now we can see a BSDF measurement example for a display. You can see here different results. So the following example outlines how to take a BSDF measurement using the Synopsis MiniDiff instrument. First, we calibrate the MiniDiff for reflection prior to the measurement by measuring black and white reference sample respectively. The reference sample are provided with the instrument. Then we place the instrument over the sample, which in this case is the surface of the display. The screen is off in order to evaluate only reflected light and not emitted light. We run an automatic measurement for angle of incidence, 0, 20, 40, and 60 degree, and for all colors, red, green, and blue. The measurement results show in the following figure correspond to the angle of incidence at 20 degree and with blue input light color. The result shows a narrow specular scattering lobe N is similar for each color and each angle of incidence. This corresponds to our visual observation that there is no color or angle dependence. If you want more information, we have a lot of resources for you. You can visit our customer support portal to watch a recording of our scattering measurement solution webinar. You can also watch a short introduction video on YouTube and also download brochure, application notes, and data sheet from our website. You can learn more about the Synopsis Master Library in our data sheet.